Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. In this episode, I'm going to demonstrate to you how you can convert your Postman request into a curl command and at the same time import a curl command into your Postman request. So let's get started. I'm going to use a Postman echo server here and I'm going to use a simple get command here to request header. And here you can see it's using an environment variable. If you hit send, if you see this error message here, or rather this message, just copy this in your clipboard like that. And then let's create a new uh, environment variable called base URL with a capital U. So I'm using version, release version 10.1.0 uh, of Postman, by the way, if you are wondering. So you have to create environment variable, like I say, click on this environment, quick lookup icon here. On this environment add and I'm gonna add base URL give it a name for this group of variable and inside there uh, you're gonna have a base URL and then uh, here the default value will be that you can call this anything you want let's call it postman echo server something like that it's just a title header and you can start adding more variable in here anyway once that's done make sure you save it Close this guy. Now, if you hit send, you'll get a response from the, let's see here. So you got to change this to this one here before we do that. So if you hit send now, you can see that the uh, Postman uh, server, echo server is responding. So uh, Postman is definitely sending a command to the Postman echo server. So how do you convert this request into a curl command? So if you navigate over to this guy here that says code, click on it and you can see this is your curl command. This is how you get your curl command, or rather convert your postman request into a curl command. So if you take this command and bring it over here to my Linux box here, I'm running Ubuntu here, and try to run that command like that, you can see you'll get the same exact result as what you see on your postman at the bottom of the screen here. So there's a couple of uh, tips, I guess. Uh, if you run the postman command, or rather the curl command, and if you put the uh, I minus I, it'll give you only the header information which is available in this section here. So that's one thing to know. And another thing I always like to do besides adding I is also using the flag K, which is to bypass any security certificate. Like for example, this guy uses HTTPS. If you have issues with a certificate, you know, you can't pull up the page, make sure you put a K in it. But nevertheless, if the certificate is not an issue, normally I will give you the header and generally the uh, the URL that you copy from the uh, postman conversion will give you the data, data that you're looking for. So that's how you do it. So that is how you convert from postman to curl. Now how do you convert or rather import a curl command into your postman? So for that, you're going to have to go to your import button here, click on it, click on raw text. Over here, let's use the same curl command that we uh, exported from our postman here. Same thing, and continue. And then after that, this thing will come up here. So import, you'll come up a new tab, and yet it has already converted all your requests into a postman request. So if you hit send here, you get the same result. So that's how you convert from curl or rather import curl into your postman. If you like this tutorial, please like and subscribe. Other than that, you have a good day. Bye now.